and a warm welcome from a venue that really oozes football history. I'm talking, of course, about the San Siro in Milan. I'm Derek Ray, here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon to help me describe all the action. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. It's Inter, and they take on Bologna. Yeah, thanks, Derek. My advice to the players out there is try and get off to a quick start, be accountable for your own performance, but above all, go out and enjoy yourself. Should be a great game. A game that should have talking points aplenty and Inter with the kickoff here. And a look at the Inter team. Samir Handanovic gets the nod in goal. Ashraf Hakimi plays with Alexander Kolarov in the fullback positions. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Palacio couldn't keep the ball. Ericsson. The ball with Martinez. It's a good looking ball in behind. The pressure was on the keeper following the threaded pass. Palacio. Very good reading of the game to win possession back. Martinez. Martinez. Still possibilities. Relentless high pressing. And unable to keep possession. convert and he's gone and scores here Romano Lukaku it's the first goal of this match well I think the keeper's expecting power he's expecting the laces to come right through that ball but he just passes it into the net a lovely lovely finish well the goal again albeit from a different angle well the coach has to be happy with that Got their noses in front. Still work to be done, though. And back playing here with Inter, the team holding the advantage. And that puts them in position. And beyond the last defender, offside. Martinez Lukaku Well, the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend Well, that was pretty much the game right there if that goes in, but not to be Ericsson The ball with Martinez Can he finish? And turned onto the woodwork. And the referee spotted the foul, but has played advantage. The referee spotted the infringement, and it will be a free kick in a position of genuine menace.
Well, a respectable enough effort, but he couldn't extend the lead. Given too much space, why not take the shot on? Good effort. on the scent of something positive. The last 15 minutes possession stats for Inter have been impressive. All parts of the... It should be! And a goal! They've increased their lead and they don't want to be throwing it away from here. Well, here's the replay, and as we see, it's a class ball through to split the defence, and he had choices of what type of finish to apply. And bang, he goes for the smash. Lovely goal. Well, no wonder he's delighted. They've been bossing this game up to now. Well, a second goal for them here. Rete dell'Inter, con il numero 10, Lautaro. Really good challenge. And the referee sees that as a foul. Free kick given. No yellow card. Instead, a firm warning from the official. Lukaku. This is Vidal. Arturo Vidal. Could it be? And there it is! Well, as we see again here, the damage is started with a beauty of a through ball. And sometimes, with all the time in the world, you can fluff your lines. But he composes himself and slips it past the keeper beautifully. Well, on with the action. Inter dominant. This is starting to get out of hand, you just feel. Well, he likes to run at them. And now, passing it through. In it goes! Such a complete performance. Four in front now. Well, here it is again. The through ball is perfectly timed. It causes havoc. And then through on goal. Do you go for placement or do you go for power? Well, he certainly wasn't messing around, was he? Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. It's a really lovely finish. Well, this is threatening to get out of hand. Just look at the scoreline. And we will have just one additional minute. Corner kick forthcoming. And we're highlighting him for a reason. He's putting in a really authoritative performance here late. Well, they've really struggled to keep him under wraps today. It's simple. His movement really causes defenders problems. And he's done that again today. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Well, this man, Romano Lukaku, is a very difficult opponent. And the verdict, Lee, positive. Well, I've got a word for that first half performance. Spectacular. He was absolutely brilliant. He's got his two goals. Let's see what he's got to offer in the second. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. It's neat passing. Confidence on the ball. Martinez. An incisive pass. Will it be Lukaku? Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. And it's gone behind for the corner. Not to be too blunt about it, but this has been a struggle for him up front, Lee. Well, if you don't get back into this game, his lack of real potency will be the key factor. Defenders have marked him too easily. They've been comfortable with his get... Real chance! But it can't get all the way through. And now the delivery. Well cleared away, but at the expense of a corner. 
played into the centre of the box. Well, it has come to nothing. Ericsson. Martinez. Promising looking ball. Can they cover up? Roberto Soriano. Perisic. Ball is loose. Well, nothing on toward happened. Well, how many goals are we going to get? The chances are just coming thick and fast. Defensively, they're all over the place. Can they make them pay a little bit more? It looks like they can. And he's gone for power. So close to finding the net. Ericsson. Martinez. And a poor attempt at a challenge, and on he goes. It's there for him. Stab a piece of defending. Roberto Soriano. Tremendously strong in the tackle. We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. And he's in. And a goal to seal the hat trick. A master class at finishing. Just can't stop him today! Well, here it is again. It's all about the pace in transition. They were so quick to get out from the back and then through on goal. You never really had any doubt he was going to slot that away. Good finish. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Well, you've got to savour such moments. Vidal. Disappointing pass. Well, there might well be scope for them to counter-attack here. Well, not to be in terms of the counter-attack. And a throw-in it's going to be. De Silvestri. Fruitful-looking attack. Given it, penalty it is. He's been admonished by the referee. He's now got to walk something of a tightrope. Yeah, he knows exactly where he stands. Look at the referee, how he's told him off there. No yellow card, but certainly knows what the referee's thinking. And the penalty is converted. A goal it is. And now he can exhale. Well, here's the replay. The keeper guesses right, but it's the height that does him. He almost dies under it. He's so unlucky in the end. A glut of goals. 5-1 it is. Con il numero 10, Nicola Sansone. Ivan Perisic. What an important piece of defending. Takes the shot. Excellent block. And he keeps going. Very alert defending to put a stop to the chance. And only two minutes remaining here. And the ball is in the net. Well, the offside flag has been raised. No goal. Well, it was close, but he just went a little bit too early.
So the final whistle has sounded and a boost for the Nerazzurri. Three points for Inter. Lee, your verdict? Well, it was a very assured performance, wasn't it? Particularly impressive up front. Their forwards really hit form today. The result was never much in doubt, if I'm honest.